Hello, I am Lori Kopp Weingarten, co-founder and president of One Stop College Counseling, located in New Jersey, but working with students throughout the country and in Asia. College Express has asked me to talk about the college admissions virtual interview. Since the COVID-19 pandemic arrived, many colleges have switched from in-person, on-campus interviews to virtual interviews. We are also expecting many alumni interviews to be conducted virtually this year. Here are some tips on how to approach the technical aspects of the online interview. First of all, make sure your computer is charged. You do not want to suddenly disconnect in the middle of an interview. Even better, have your computer plugged into a power source. Use a computer, not a phone or tablet if possible. Keep your camera at eye level. You might need to put a book under your computer to accomplish that. Speak into the camera so that it appears as if you are making eye contact. Turn off all email notifications before the interview starts. You don't want your computer beeping and buzzing during the interview. Don't have a lot of distractions on the video. Choose a quiet place with an uncluttered background if you're doing this in your bedroom, make sure it's not a mess. Make your bed, don't have clothes or clutter on the floor, and close your closet door. Avoid wearing white, bright red, and all black outfits. They don't typically look good on camera. Blues, greens, purples, and pinks are a good choice, and solids often work well. Do not have a light source behind you. It will make it harder to see your face. The light should be in front of you. Facing a window is ideal. Some people use a lamp or a ring light in front of the computer to ensure their face is clearly visible. So the other day, we were doing a mock interview with a student and they had their window open behind them. And literally all I could see was his silhouette of his face. He had to actually get up and close the blinds so that we could see who he was. Ask a friend or a family member to do a run through with you an hour before your scheduled interview so you can check that your audio and video works and that your lighting is good. Verify that your face is well lit and that your background looks appropriate. Play around with the camera angle to make sure that you are centered in the video at a suitable distance from the camera. Recently in another mock interview, we had a student put um, her face right up to the camera, which was very disorienting. Um, so you definitely wanna do a run through. Remind people not to enter, place a do not disturb um, interviewing note on the door. Check the time zone of your interview, do not be late. In another interview we did recently, our students slept through the mock interview because it was in a different time zone and they forgot to check. Sit up straight, speak slowly, enunciate and smile. Be personable, enthusiastic and friendly, just like you would during an in-person conversation. Don't forget to send a thank you note to the interviewer when it's all over. You will be amazed how many interviewers never receive a thank you note. And that's it. Relax, be yourself, and ace that interview. Thanks for watching.